Good morning, afternoon, or evening. Matt the Butcher here. In this video, I'm going to be going over five essential items for a butcher besides the knives. These five essential items that I'm going to be sharing with you have helped me out tremendously throughout my career. Uh, whether you're an amateur or professional, I believe that they will help you out as well. Stay tuned until the end because I got a bonus tool that's really, really helped me out. Hey, before we get into the video, uh, can you guys please like and subscribe and comment below for any uh, future videos that you'd like to see me do. Let's get the ball rolling. Number one, a meat hook. Man, I have had this meat hook since day one. It has helped me out so tremendously. This guy has so many uses. For instance, scraping the blade bone on this lamb shoulder for clean removal or removing this pig's tongue for a cleaner cut or even just carrying large sections of beef that you can't seem to get a good grip on. You can grab it one hand and then the other one a little bit farther away and, and hook a bone and carry it across a room with no problem. Using this meat hook is really gonna save your grip throughout the day if you have a long day of breaking down uh, you know, beef carcasses or, or larger animals like that, uh, whether it's on a rail system or even if you're table breaking. Seriously guys, this is a must have. All right, number Two, a handsaw. Oh man, this has come in handy so many times to get the job done, old trusty style. If you don't have power to your electric saw or if your bandsaw blade just snapped, uh, man, this is a great backup to have, always. I bring this bad boy with me everywhere I go. I like how this is a smaller handsaw here because this can break down anything from a goat to a beef carcass. Also easy to clean as the blade just comes out and is easy to store by just flipping the blade up so it doesn't accidentally hurt anyone. Hands off, it's a beautiful thing. Number three, bottle of mineral oil. Sheesh, this has come in handy like a flashlight at night. Lubrication is the best and I don't think anyone's gonna argue with that. I have probably used gallons of this in the past 10 years and a little bit goes a long way. I use mineral oil for all types of stuff, like lubricating exposed gears on your stuffer or your grinder, or sliding shaft for the guard on a slicer, or oil on your tri-stone sharpener. Mineral oil is even great to have around the house uh, to put you know, on a squeaky door hinge or like exposed metal that may be rusting. Having a small bottle of mineral oil that you can keep with you is a must have. Number four, a knife bag. Man, do I love this thing. It may seem pretty obvious, but a lot of butchers I've worked with just have toolboxes that they throw all their knives into. This is gonna prevent uh, your knives from chipping and banging together. It really helps with uh, traveling as you can just take this strap here and sling it over your shoulder. Knife bag, baby, it's a must have. Number five, butcher's twine. Butcher's twine is the duct tape of the butcher's world. Man, the amount of things I have done with this butcher's twine is mind blowing. To name a few projects like tying a roast for even cooking or tying a salami for even drying, hanging a calendar, hanging tape, tying trezo chubs nice and tight, attaching a pen to your clipboard, kitchen lights hanging low, use butcher's twine. Don't have a tripod to record your birds eating seeds? Use butcher's twine to attach your phone to a garden pole. You see people, how could you not have butcher's twine on you at all times? It's the bee's knees, it's the cat's meow, it's the zebra's eyebrows, baby. Okay guys, I've shown you five material items that have helped me out immensely through my career. Now I'm gonna share with you one more. Social media. Looking back at the last 10 years of my butchery career and comparing the first five years to the last five years uh, has been completely different all because social media platforms. There was almost nothing online except for a few individuals giving, you know, nuggets of really good information on butchery, which I'd eventually like to make a video dedicated to them. But either way, the education I get on a daily basis following uh, and connecting with some of the best in the business is, I mean, it's incredible. And it's free. You guys, I can't express enough how important it is to make a social media network. I've made so many farmer, butcher, and cook friends that I've connected with all over the country. I've gotten so many jobs and contracts just from those connections alone. It's almost the most valuable tool that I've had besides the knives. There you go, guys. There's uh, five essential items besides the knives plus one. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Uh, please like and subscribe. 
and comment below. Uh, if you have any other video ideas, please let me know. I'm having a lot of fun doing these and connecting with you guys. So keep it up. Thank you so much.